Hello. My name. <coughs> Excuse me. My. Something is wrong here. I was malfunctioning. What was I doing? Malfunctioning. That means I wasn't working properly. I fixed myself. My name is Keshwani. Can you say Keshwani? That's K E S H W A N I. Keshwani. We are here because we want to learn math. We met. We met day before yesterday. Day before yesterday, we learned times table of two. Yesterday, we learned three table. Today, we're going to learn four table. Are you ready? Let's begin. Shall we? Let's begin. Four ones are. Four twos are. Four threes are. Four fours are. Four fives are. And let's find out the answer, shall we? So we're going to count by fours. We're going, to, we're going to learn today. We're going to learn today to count by fours. So let's begin. Four ones. We need four ones. There is one one. There is another one. So that's two ones. There is another one. That's three ones. And four one. Four ones are. Well, let's find out. One, two, three, four. Obviously, four ones are four. Four ones are four. What if we had four twos? Four, four twos. Four twos are. Let's find out. So shall we? There is one two. That's a group of two. There is another group of two. There's two twos. There's three twos. And that's four twos. Now we have four twos. Four twos are, let's find out, shall we? Two, four, six, and eight. Looks like four, four twos are eight. Four twos are eight. How about four threes? Now we have to find a group of threes. So here is a group for first group of three. There is a second group of three. We have two threes. There is a third group of three. That's three threes and four threes. How much do you suppose four threes are going to be? Let's find out. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 4 threes are 12, it seems. 4 threes are 12. These digits have to line up, so we have to go back and fix this 4 and the 8. There we go. Now let's do 4 4, shall we? Oh, what did I do now? I messed it all up, didn't I? We need 4 4s. There we go, fixed. Four fours, shall we? There is a first group of four. We need four fours. There is seven group, uh, second group of four. Here is a third group of four, and here is the fourth group of four. Four fours are. Let's find out what four fours are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Four fours are sixteen. Four fours are sixteen. What about four fives? Well, let's add, we have four fours. Let's add one to everything. Let's add one to everybody. So now we have a group of fives. Fives are very easy to count. Five plus five is ten. Ten plus five is fifteen. And fifteen plus five is twenty. So it's going to be twenty. Now let's do the let's do the second half of the table, shall we? Four six are. Four sevens are. Four eights are, four nines are, and finally four tens are. So now we have to count by sixes. We have to count by sixes. Two, four, six. Right? Two, four, six, that's right. Now here's a quicker way to, to separate the six because each row has ten of them. Each row has ten of them. So if I count four from here, one, two, three, four, and I just separate here, that's a six. Because now we got a six here and four there, you see? That's the lazy man's out, you see? Instead of counting, instead of counting six, I'm only counting four. One, two, three, four. If I take away, there you go, that's a six. Because we're subtracting six from the ten, you see? There is ten of them here. Or rather, we're subtracting four. There is ten of them here. If we just take away four, one, two, three, four. If I take away four, the remaining must be six. Four, four sixes are, four sixes are right here. Four six are. Let's find out, shall we? So that's six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, and 24. Looks like 4, 6 is a 24. How about 4, 7s? Well, we already have 4, 6s, and 4, 6s we know is 24. 
Let's add one more, one more to each group, so that will give us four sevens. So we have 24 already. By adding one more here, we get 25, 26, 27, 28. Four sevens are 28. Four sevens are 28. What about, what about four eights? Well, this, up to here is 28 here. Now we add one more to this thing to so get eight here. That's 29, 30, 31, 32. Four eights are 32. Four eights are 32. What about four nines? Well, we add four more to it. One, one to each group. 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. Now we have four nines. There's the first nine, second nine, third nine, and fourth nine. We have four nine. Four nines are four nines are thirty-six. Four nines are thirty-six, and this is how we write it. We write four four nines are thirty-six. Four nines are thirty-six. Now we need four tens. We need we need four tens. That's very easy, isn't it? Just bring everything here. 1 ten, 2 tens, 3 tens, 4 tens. And counting by 10 is very easy. 10 plus 10 is 20, 20 plus 10 is 30, 30 plus 10 is 40. 4 tens are 40. 4 tens are 40. 4 tens are 40. 4 nines are 36. 4 nines are 36. This, this sentence here says 4 nines are means equal. 4 nines are 36. And we just found out that 4 tens are 40. That's the end of our table. Tomorrow we'll learn 5's table. We have to go all the way up to 12. You understand? And then we'll begin our process of doing math problems. But first we have to learn our tables. Okay? I'll see you tomorrow. Okay? Bye now.